Well, there is a lot of talk about climate change today. How does that fit into what you understand? Well, there's some people are concerned that we may be going back into another ice age. Mm. And uh, this really it helps us to understand why some people are so concerned about uh, a short period of global warming or cooling. There is a viewpoint within the community of paleoclimatologists, these are people who study old climates, that just before an ice age starts, they believe that there's an instability so that the, the climate gets very warm and then it gets very cold and it's oscillating. Mm. And so they see the climate as very unstable, very sensitive to small changes. So that if we put in pollution in the atmosphere, the particulates or gases, and possibly contribute to some instability, that it will suddenly go to an ice age. As a young earth creationist, I believe that the atmosphere and climate is very stable. In fact, it took a major catastrophic event like the Genesis flood to kick off the climate change that we saw that produced the ice age. So that's why there's a major difference in viewpoint uh, between different people about how unstable or stable the climate is. Uh -huh. So again, the conventional paradigm seeks to understand all of that through current processes. Uh, so uh, we have almost natural uh, events going on that create ice age after ice age, as opposed to what you're saying, and that is that if, you need, if you're gonna get an ice age, you have to have some really, really catastrophic events and some very unique conditions. Very high energy events in order to be able to cause the atmosphere to react the way it yeah. did. Yeah.